Business Watch brought to you by End Cash. Scan Pay Done. In the Trinidad and Tobago Chamber of Industry and Commerce's National Budget Recommendations, which was posted on the Chamber's website on Tuesday, the issue of the airbridge was placed in focus. The Chamber notes the airbridge being down from 20 flights a day to 12 flights a day is not enough. The Chamber admits, however, the service is not economic as it is directional at busy periods. However, it argues that the commerce between the islands makes up for that fact as it states, but to Trinidad and Tobago, it is economic as Tobago buys most of its products from Trinidad. The Chamber continues, it also reduces foreign exchange leakage. The more Trinidadians holiday in Tobago and do not go to other islands, the better for the TNT economy. The Chamber has also called on the Tobago House of Assembly to consider paying to keep the ANR Robinson Airport open later, while also calling for a transit desk to be established to assist in reducing flying time to international travellers who may wish to fly to Tobago via Trinidad. Local investors often miss out on market gains due to risk-averse bias. This was one observation made by Ishan Gosain, Head of Investments at NCB Merchant Bank Trinidad and Tobago, during a webinar hosted by the Trinidad and Tobago Stock Exchange concerning effective trading strategies tailored for various market conditions. This bias, which is a cognitive bias, which could be corrected, is very important because Basically, this bias could cause you to buy stocks when they're high and sell them when they're low, which is exactly the opposite of what you should be doing um, when you're trading. Gosain used Republic Bank's shares as an example, noting that some sold stock when the bank hit a momentary rough period. You know, they have good quarters, great quarters, and then they have one bad quarter, and you say, well, I think it will fall. Um, and basically, you end up missing out on, on the fact that Republic Bank ultimately went up to 140, so you missed out on that gain solely because, you know, you, you were risk averse and, and worried. And now for a look at today's energy and foreign exchange prices. Peter Christopher, CNC3 Business Watch. Business Watch, brought to you by End Cash. Scan, pay, done.